Fruit juice is not a health food. In fact, it's actually worse for you than many soft drinks, sodas, Coke, Pepsi. Yeah, you heard me right. In this video, I'm gonna explain how fruit juice is in many cases are worse for you than soft drinks. I'm Dr. Ken Berry, a family physician with 20 years of clinical experience. And I'm gonna blow up the myth that fruit juice is a healthy drink for human beings. You see the beautiful, colorful boxes of fruit juice in the supermarket, and they have big words on the front like organic, non-GMO, all natural, no sugar added. How could these things possibly be harmful to your health or harmful to your children's health? Trust me, they are. The problem is fructose. You've probably heard about high fructose corn syrup in soft drinks or sodas, right? And we all know that the, there's too much fructose in that. They actually magnify the amount of fructose versus glucose to come up with high fructose corn syrup made from corn. So all this extra fructose has to be metabolized by your liver and only your liver. Your body can't use it in any other way. And if you just took an occasional sip of a soda or a sip of fruit juice occasionally, wouldn't be a big deal at all. Your liver could handle that fine. The problem is, is when you drink a, a container of fruit juice. And the, the really monstrous thing about this is we're so deluded into thinking that fruit juice is healthy. Uh, for a large part of my life, I thought that, that orange juice was the healthiest drink in the world. I would slam down a quart of orange juice a day, not realizing the fructose danger. When your liver is inundated with a huge amount of fructose that it gets from a soft drink or from some fruit juices, it cannot metabolize it all quickly enough. And so it winds up storing some of this fructose in the form of fat inside your liver. This happens to human beings of all ages, including toddlers and young children. In fact, the fatty liver epidemic in the United States and other parts of the world it's getting out of hand and it's all because number one, some parents are just dumb and let their kids drink soft drinks. Number two, some parents are smart and they give their children fruit juices as opposed to soft drinks. But the problem with this is, is that many fruit juices actually contain more fructose than soft drinks that are sweetened with high fructose corn syrup. Yeah, not lying. I'm gonna pop some graphics up during this video so you can actually compare the different fruit juices and be amazed at how much fructose are in some of these fruit juices. Developing a fatty liver is really, really bad, but it's not the only bad thing that fructose can do in your body. Fructose is also very glycating. It's actually seven to 10 times more glycating than just glucose. And now, what does that mean? That means that it basically gums up the surface of all the cells in your body, all the cells in your child's body. So the cells don't function as efficiently, they get old quicker than they should, and they, they cause miscommunication between cells and other cells, which leads to degraded function of the cell, which ultimately leads to chronic disease. Also, many people, their colon is very sensitive to fructose, and if they have more than just a little bit, they can have significant irritable bowel symptoms. And so most people would never think to blame the, the natural, organic, non-GMO fruit juice they drink for their bathroom problems. But in many, many people, that is the case. The average young parent has no idea that fruit juice can be so unhealthy. And, and that's the, really the part that triggers the, me the most is the, the false nutrition facade that's put around fruit juices, that they are such an infinitely better choice than soft drinks, and they ain't. Drinking fruit juice on a daily basis is so unhealthy that the American Academy of Pediatrics actually came out with guidelines. They said that a child under one year of age should consume no fruit juice whatsoever. A child between the ages of one and three can, may have up to four ounces of fruit juice a day, but no more. A child between the ages of four and six can have six ounces max a day. Now, doesn't this sound a lot like the, the USDA guidelines about alcohol? You can have one or two drinks a day, but no more than that if you want to be healthy. Well, 
if, if it's unhealthy to drink more than drinking that little amount, that's probably just less unhealthy, but yet unhealthy. Children between the ages of seven and 18 can have up to eight ounces a day, according to the AAP. Uh, a seven-year-old child, as you know, is much, much different than an 18-year-old child. So saying that a seven-year-old can have eight ounces of fruit juice, just like an 18-year-old, that's kind of dumb. And I would, I would never give a child that's, that's seven or eight years old that much fruit juice. We currently have a 15-month-old little one, and he has not ingested one drop of fruit juice his entire life. He's vigorous, he's vibrant, he's healthy, he's outgoing, he's intelligent. Somehow, he doesn't seem to be missing out on that magical nutrition that we're all told is in fruit juices. If you know a young parent who's overworked, overstressed, and currently deluded by false advertising into thinking that fruit juice is good for their little one, please consider sharing this video with them. It can make all the difference between that little one developing fatty liver, type 2 diabetes as a child, becoming obese, or them living a happy, healthy young life. Again, let's talk about the labels. If it says on the, the glass or the carton of juice, no sugar added, that's exactly like uh, buying a, a five pound bag of sugar and it says on the bag of sugar, no sugar added to the sugar because fruit juice is pure liquid sugar and it's the worst of all sugars, fructose. Please click that subscribe button on your way out. Thanks for joining me. This is Dr. Barry. I'll see you next time.